Hey guys, so I'm just taking a quick break from work and I wanted to jump on here and share kind of this idea that's been going through my mind that I made the mental shift a little while ago and it's taken a lot of anxiety and pressure off of me. So I thought, hey, if it could help you, if this mental mind shift could help you, um, then it's so worth it. So it's that mind shift from thinking about value versus cost. So what I mean by that is whenever we're presented with a new idea, one of the most common things that goes into our head almost instantly is how much does it cost? And it's not that that's a bad thing to think about. That's just kind of what we've been programmed to think. And unfortunately in our society, you need money to live, right? So it's almost like become an innate reaction to think, okay, how much does this cost? And that's stressful. It causes a lot of anxiety and stress around making decisions on what to spend money on and what not to spend money on. So what I do is I now don't think about the cost of things. I swap it and I catch myself. I say, okay, what's the value of this new opportunity or this new thing or whatever is being presented to me? What's the value? And in order to understand and, and figure out what the value is, you need to know what your priorities are, right? So for my, for myself, um, you've heard me say it before, my top priorities are myself, my health, right? Because I'm nothing without me and my body, so my health. Uh, my second priori priority are my family and my relationships, right? And then my third priority is my, my job, my passion, serving others, right? So I look at this opportunity, whatever's in front of me, I say, you know, is there strong value in this that would align with my top three priorities? Would this serve my top three priorities? Because when I do things, when I spend money on things or my time on things on these top pri top three priorities, that's what makes me feel good. That's what makes me happy. But when I spend time, money, resources with things that don't align with these priorities, that's when I feel stress and anxiety and like I'm wasting money. I don't see the value. So I look at this new opportunity and I think, okay, does it line up with myself, my health and fitness? Does it line up with serving my family, my relationship? And does it line up with my passion, my career, serving others? And if it lines up with that, I usually go for it. That's, that's a great decision, I say, right? If it doesn't line up with those priorities, if there's no value in it to serve my top priorities, then I usually don't go with it, right? So you'll see me make a lot of my decisions say yes to a lot of things like... Um, fitness programs, personal development books, um, different nutritional things, um, trips or dinners with my family, um, you know, events, traveling with my team, um, any different way I can serve you guys and share knowledge with you. Hey Jackie, what you see me not spending money on are things I don't value that much. Um, and you know, lots of like material things. I mean, I like pretty things. I like good things, but um, you see what I wear every day. I don't spend a lot of money on clothes or things like that, right? I don't spend a lot of money on, you know, like we live in a 700 square foot home. I mean, I'd love a big house one day, but that's not a priority right now. Um, junk food or, um, you know, like just stuff that just doesn't align with those priorities. So for me, it has, cause I'm not a very good decision maker. I'm not at all. I stress about it. I get anxiety. Um, so this has made making decisions so much easier because I'm clear about what my priorities are. And then I'm clear about figuring out, okay, is this valuable to me? Um, because you can't base things on cost in my mind, right? Like it's because if there's so much value in it that it makes you so much better and so much happier, then the cost shouldn't really matter or you'll come up with the money. Let's just be honest, right? When the value's there, you're going to come up with the money. Um, but if you don't see the value in it, the money's not going to be there, whether you think, whether it is or not, your mind says it's not right. So when you're making decisions, think about the value. Hey, Lisa. Hey, Sharon. 
when you're making decisions, you guys, don't let cost just be the first thing that pops into your mind because you're going to hold yourself back from so many opportunities and so many chances to align with your priorities. You know what I mean? Like that's the number one reason people aren't happy is because they're making decisions that don't align with their priorities. Like if your family's priority number one and you're not, and you're, you're working all day long and you're not with them, you're going to be frustrated. If health is your priority, but you're friggin' eating ice cream all day long every day because you can't get the sugar out of your system. Of course you're going to be angry, right? Aw, thanks, Caitlin. <laughs> so it's just, it's as simple as that. Don't let cost hold you back. Figure out what your priorities are. Say your top three priorities. And when you're presented with an opportunity or something that comes up to you, say, what is the value in this? If it aligns with my priorities, then there is strong value and I should probably say yes. If it does not align with my priorities, doesn't agree with them, then I should probably say no. Money is not the issue, you guys. Understanding the value is because invest your money in good stuff. Invest your money in your top three priorities and you're going to live a happier and healthier life. Okay? I hope that helps. That's how. That's what's helped me, so I hope it can help you too. Um, have an awesome day, guys. I got to get back to work. Love you and thank you so much for jumping on.